Did Bolivia's President Luis Arc have prior knowledge of the foiled coup? A day after dramatic scenes at the Murillo Plaza in La Paz saw an armored vehicle ram into the presidential palace gate and this confrontation between President and his army general. There are questions now being raised about whether it was a coup or a self-coup. Before General Zuniga was arrested, he himself had claimed that President Ark had asked him to do something to boost his popularity without giving evidence of it. Now a similar allegation has surfaced from a minister. Si esto no haya sido un autogolpe, en el momento que ha hecho las declaraciones Zúñiga, creo que ha sido el día lunes, ya el presidente debía cambiarlo de, de comandante y general de las Fuerzas Armadas, pero tal cosa no, apare, no, no ocurrió. Entonces han querido concretizar este supuesto golpe de Estado, es un, para nosotros eh, un golpe planificado del gobierno, que solamente para qué estaba dirigido. Habíamos denunciado que ya como Zúñiga ha declarado o oh, matar a Evo o apresar a Evo. Latin America is not new to the concept of autogolp, which refers to a sitting president trying to seize extraordinary power when he can't manage to do it in the normal circumstances. Bolivia is not new to coups either, but this attempt came after a gap of 40 years. It also comes on the back of a power struggle between Luis Arc and his one-time ally turned adversary, Evo Morales. Morales is looking to challenge Arc in next year's presidential elections and this has divided the left-leaning party. For his part, the president has denied that he had any prior information regarding the coup. Primero, eh, sobre las supuestas informaciones que él nos hubiera, que el general Zúñiga nos hubiera hecho a nosotros. Para nada. Para nada. Nunca estuvimos informados sobre lo que él pretendía, menos de las movilizaciones que él las realizó. Y por supuesto, todo lo contrario, más bien, ¿no? hemos quedado sorprendidos por ese hecho. Él estaba desacatando, estaba incumpliendo órdenes que su capitán general le estaba dando. Entonces, ¿cómo podía ser pues, una instrucción o una planificación de un autogolpe? Bolivia is also facing an economic turmoil and the government hasn't had much progress on getting a handle on it. The foiled coup attempt may give the current president a shot in the arm in terms of support at a time when his popularity was falling. But he will need to take more concrete steps to tackle the economic crisis Bolivia is facing.